My favorite Stevie Wonder song would probably would have to be Ribbon in the Sky. And if please, may I once again. You know, his voice is so magical. Everything he plays from, you know, piano to harmonica, you know, he gets a chance to express himself and, you know, touch people's souls with just his music. And not, he doesn't have to dance, he doesn't have to do anything. He just has to, you know, sing. And he can, be, can get that emotion from you just doing that. Stevie Wonder is, to me personally, everything to this music industry. I think he influences so many other artists. And I think um, during his time when, when he was in his prime, he kind of influenced a lot of the people around him, even, you know, Michael to everybody. I think everybody kind of loved Stevie and he kind of he got it down. So, you know, shout out to Stevie. You a chef? You a chef? Well, you... <laughs> That's happening at the yeah. carries. Happening at the carries. Uh, I'm, I'm some green cheese. Some green cheese. Uh huh. Yeah. Uh huh. Put, Put some salt on the shit. Put some elbow on the shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Put some elbow on the elbow grease. Ah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah. We seasoning now. Yeah, stuff the shit up. <laughs> I think y'all real gangsters. Let me show y'all how real gangsters dance. Hands on the floor, dancing like we're sex. That's how real gangsters dance. Get off of me, dog. I don't see nobody, but the dog see me. I don't see nobody. Get away from me, doggy. I don't I don't see nobody. Hit him with the tongue. I don't I don't see nobody. Hit him with the tongue. I don't I don't see nobody. I don't see nobody. He wasn't here. Don't worry about it, because now it's competition, nigga. You guys, but I'm going to hear Like a tracker, that nice guys, nice ways. And you know I can't forget about it. Ain't no food you sit in here, it's a food party. You come to party. is to bring the community together. There's a lot of lines in this community that we're trying to work together with, with intervention, with the community to erase those lines, to make it safe for anybody to go anywhere. So what I want to do today is I want to highlight some of the people who are in your community, who are in your neighborhoods, who are helping to reduce violence. I want to thank Chris Brown and Green Rock for doing all he does. I cannot begin to tell you how this makes me feel being able to be here at Lock High School and for Chris Brown to bring his team here willing to play LAPD. I just want to thank you personally, brother, from the bottom of my heart for reaching out to my community to help us with the reduction of violence. So thank you all for coming. Thank you for supporting this. And uh, I want to see a good basketball game.
Well, today is the she drive, you know, uh, the walk of life, that's what we call it. <laughs> but today is for all the kids, you know, I've, I've done this my second one. I think the Re Reebok, we got them to donate a thousand shoes. So I wanted to bring it to different inner cities, like with all the kids, Rex and the things like that, to bring everybody together. Being able to give those shoes to those, those kids whose parents maybe couldn't afford it or they have real bills to pay. You know, just giving them an opportunity to just have fun and just have a good day. With this campaign, I just want to achieve unity. That's all it is. At the end of the day, differences can be set aside, whether it's blood, grip, anything that's negative. I just want, want it to be uh, kind of a reality check that, come on, let's do right. I really think about my family, I really think about where I come from, you know, everybody in here. And I see the smiles on these kids' faces, it's just like, it's like Christmas to me, so it's fun. I just want to thank everybody for coming out, man, it means a lot. Giving back to the hood, showing love, man, I appreciate everybody here, who, everybody who came out, all the families, all the little kids, all the mamas. Everybody, I love y'all, man. I'm still here. I'm not leaving. I just wanted to say thank you. You don't really get to see a lot of places that had this like natural beauty, you know? It's, it's like, you get a chance to go and see the cities and you see meet different people and that's great, but sometimes it's good to see this. Like when I saw it, I just came out here because it's just, you don't see this nowhere. You can't you can't get it, you know? It's somewhere you can think. And when, when everybody else in the world is kind of dealing with their problems, you can kind of deal with yours here. I've been through a lot, been through some things, you know, so it's, a, it's another chance for people to see if I can fail or succeed. So it's, it's really a double-edged sword. So I just got to be up to par and bring my A-game at all times and, and just show the world what, what my talent is and, and promote that sort of positivity. It's not, a, it's not about, you know, what the next story is or what people want to say all the time. I try not to have my mind surrounded by by that stuff because stuff like this is the importance and I like just being able to make people smile, everybody around us have fun, to enjoy the moments that they have on this earth. I actually have a puppy uh, bulldog. Her name is Dirty Diana. Puppies is like, nah, we, we run.
Uh, okay. Fresh up off the stove, I'm hotter than a bitch. Black diamond automark is holding down my wrist on the shit. You playing, nigga, you know my name, dawg. And shawty let me cut, call me Mr. Chainsaw. This beat goes so hard, and so does your broad. And when you see me, if it's easy, from this your fall. Lamborghini, Fettuccine, count this dope, dawg. Big ice on my neck look like snowballs. Anyway, that I get it, I don't care how I do it, when I do it, I do it. And you know me, you shit on niggas and I do it in public. I know you mad, boy, and I ain't trying to brag. I, I'm just talking about the shit that you wish you had. Nigga, my tattoos compliment my attitude. Light skin nigga, but I'm not an average dude. You a opener, and I go on after you. Headliner, I hope you niggas read the news. <laughs> Like that sometimes. I'll just play around. Let me know what it is. There's a little something. You see him right now? Hell yeah, son. It is November. We got a book. And got it book. is freezing. It's December. Oh, it's December already? Okay, I'm, I'm gonna, it is December. And it is freezing. Hey, man, I'm gonna tell you something. 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 And it is cold! Right, down by the wall, we got concert, here we go! Bitch ass. Yo, in that yo, water. Yo, in that yo, water. Yo, yo. <laughs> we got the beautiful people stems up. And I just want to broke it down here. Take your time, take your time. Take your sweet time. Don't lose your head, lose your head. Okay, yeah. Yeah, it, it, yeah it, it's on the same thing. It's just a little bit slow. I think it's just a, a catching a little bit. Oh, we can add all the times. Boom, 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 That's good. That's be still. We gonna add some crazy shit to the world. Boom, boom, boom. This is one of the moments in in life where you kind of say, "I hate my job." So I came in a two seater, and I ain't tryna leave here alone by myself. Hey, it feels so good to meet her. Put her number and her picture in my phone. And got rid of everybody else Oh, listen to me, girl Girl, you know you don't want to You don't want to start the moon That's who you are Put one hand in the air And keep the other one in your hair And baby, show me How you get down low to the floor On this song It's only one mission I'm on God, we come to you asking you to please bless us. Let us give these people the greatest show of their lives and let us go do our thing. We've been fortunate enough to go through every, every, every show uh, positive and, and, you know, giving the audience what they want. Thank you for everything you've, you've put upon us, all the blessings and all the energy you've surrounded this whole camp with positive energy. Bless each individual that's on this stage tonight. Let us have a great, great, great energetic live performance. And I just want to thank everybody who's, who's been a part of this camp, CBE, regardless whoever you with. I just appreciate y'all being around and being a uh, part of positivity. Thank you for everybody that's with us. Thank you for everybody that's part of CBE, Team Breezy, the whole nine. Thank you for all the gifts and abilities that you put in each and every one of our lives. Everybody who works, everybody who works hard, 110%. Thank you for all the blessings. In your name, I pray to God. Let us. Amen. 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 Amen.
Those are the real deal. Wow, I need these. This some shit you can slide to. Yeah. Slide to. Believe that. What you do at ah. night. Ah. Yeah, baby. Yeah, yeah baby. Yeah. I'm so. not that shit to be high to. So that's why, baby. After the club. When so. everybody's drunk as fuck. You know I'm fucked up. You know what's up. You know what's up. I'm on my way. Let's go. Yeah. 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 I'm on my way. On my way. You know you want it. What? Had a long day. Choreographers are fly styles. When you step, you at full extension. So step, step, step. There you go, bro. Rich and Tone, Talawega Brothers. So after you be in the middle in the front of the box, they're going to slide up and then they're going to slide to the side. You know, those guys kind of always have that different kind of swag, different kind of you know technique they bring to the game. And I think it's just like rock talent and you know just energy you know it's not so ordinary it's always something that they bring extra they'll give you that extra mm. to make you want to go just as hard on stage you know they dance with madonna you know michael jackson you know with the greats and they, and they know the magic in dancing and they know the magic behind that you know and so those guys can bring their own swag and they're from the bay area so you know, they got a whole different kind of swag out there. That's what you should be eating every day, man. Don't eat no goddamn Popeye. Man, don't eat no fucking Popeye. Don't eat no fucking Popeye. I can't help it. I love the food. So being able to dance with those guys and learn from them is kind of great. There's a lot of entertainers out there that sing really nice. And there's some entertainers out there who dance real nice that can't really sing really nice. And there's some entertainers out there that rap real cool and can't dance at all. And there's some entertainers that sing dope and dance dope, but then can't rap and they show sucks. And there's some entertainers who like rap dope and dance dope. Actually, there's really no rappers that dance. I don't know why, but anyways. And then there's some special cats who got like all three weapons that's like busting, singing, and then come to the show and just like tearing down the ceiling, hitting you with like nice larynxes. That's my man CB. For real. This nigga CB is coming with a triple threat. Bam. You are so special. There's something wrong with him. Let's go. Put your stone aside. There's something wrong with him. Mm -hmm. 
Ain't I sexy? Sam. Thank you. Sam. Oh, I am. You look fantastic. Aww. I'm gonna keep this face on the whole time. I ain't your Baby, you got me confused. I ain't playing games with ya.
Now we can't get it though. 
When they asked me in the interview, who's the best friend you work with? I said Chris, because you never know what the frig's gonna happen. I might get nightmare, yeah. then I do my shit, kill, kill, Michael Myers. Yeah. I'ma do my shit, flame, flame, that's the fire. Yeah. I'ma do my shit, puff, 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 I get higher. Damn, sky diver, floating down the street. Yeah. Doing my own thing, and my niggas on the beat. Got Aaron doing it, young world swimming shit. Yeah. Don't do that shit, but I am the truest. Hey. Stupid, hey. stupid, 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 Those kids, they like. I'm gonna just talk about it for the rest of the day. Yeah, let us know. 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 Oh, that's so crazy. I like that. <laughs> you are such a good sport for doing that. Mm -hmm. He don't laugh all that. Oh my God, that's so history. Oh my God, look at that face. You ain't bad, you ain't nothing. Like that. Because <laughs> it's a curl, girl. <laughs> that's what it is. Nothing but a curl. <laughs> How does it feel when you shake? Are they on the loose stones? It's still okay? No, it ain't coming off. That shit ain't going nowhere to look you. Can my son come in? Imagine an alternate life. This was my job. I was impersonating Michael Jackson on Hollywood Boulevard, and this was my job. Yo, man, if I could, I would try to make my studio look something like this. Time to celebrate like I just Home sweet home. Then we get ready to party, I'ma show you how. So when you start, do you have any, like, idea of what you want to do, or is it just sort of like freehand? Type just thing? freehand? Yeah. Whatever comes up. Is it like wrist techniques you use? Or is it just yeah, Kid Zoom taught me a couple of wrist techniques, but it's just by holding the can to the side, like them work. Different caps? Yeah, different caps give you a different uh, mm -hmm. pressurized, so you can do smaller lines, bigger lines. Yeah. It's easier than you think, kids, so y'all can do it. Yeah. 
then you start shaping it. You can start seeing how the feet form around. Yep. This should be terrifying the whole neighborhood. Yeah. <laughs> Yes, and we're painting in the dark. In the dark. In the dark. In the dark. How many glasses are there? Uh, cup. It's about sorry. seven or eight of them, but it's more down, down by the uh, as you go on the steps and shit. They don't know about us. So you do different shades in the eyes so they pop out? Yeah, I ain't even get started on them yet. I'm about to start. So you can see it in there. That's your heart. <coughs> yep. I'm going to get split by that one. Yeah. That's it. There it might. How is it? Well. Paint's going to have a fuck of this shit. I was going to do it with all of them on. I was going to put all of them on. That's a lot of fucking jury. Oh my god. Oh my god. Sorry. That is not the cat. Dad. That is close enough, right? That is not. That looks like the dead fisherman. But you should just try your pimp walk instead of that. Pimp walk works the best. See, you need to work. See, here it goes. Check out the pimp walk. The hand, see how the hand hang up? So now you try. <laughs> Do the dolphin. Oh, gee. All y'all other cats, we really do this. The Billboard Awards is coming, yo, man. Yo, get out of here, my dude. 
Hey yo, what's up? This is B-Boy Twix, one of Chris Brown's official dancers. We up here at Third Encore Studios, rehearsing for the 2013 Billboard Music Awards. This is our third day of rehearsal. Try to smash it again. And you know I can't forget about your face, but don't mind if that matters. I'm about to make your pockets better. I just wanna see you. But you know what? Up to me. Camera guy, I can't wait to be there. Yo, yo, it's coming. The Billboard Awards is coming. The Billboard Awards. Looking sick. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna put it right there on the door. Come on. Like Since I was young, like five, six years old, I was always drawing and I used to always take pride in kind of winning like the coloring contest or like the drawing contest that they would have during like first, second grade. <laughs> it just helps me with my creativity. I think it just makes me stay young, stay youthful. Watching cartoons, I, I like love cartoons. Whether I'm in a studio session, at home, any of those cartoon based channels that always give you imaginary worlds or places you can go away because that's why I get to escape within my music my mind itself, uh, art, you know, in general. And I think all those keep me fresh. Video games keep me fresh. Ideas for movies, ideas for my own videos, all that stuff I incorporate into one. You know? Like, and that's just breezy art.
Hold on, let me see. Yeah. This is how we do TMZ exclusive. Hey, this is good. This is good. Filming. We're filming. <laughs> filming as he films me. So you're filming me, filming you. Filming yes. Me. We out here. Yes. We filming. As the paparazzi runs. He runs. Trying to get his perfect shot. Crazy, maybe I'm trying to find love, but usually I'm not that guy. Chasing you, lady, but I'm trying to get you out of this club. Cause when we in the car, panties go down. And when I get you to the crib, I'm gonna put it down. You know, you got me standing up, so I gotta lay it down. We gon' wake up the neighbors, I'ma try to make you disabled. Single, even though you got a man, black and Puerto Rican with the span. When you okay. land on the top flip, don't do two spins. You're going to be too high. Sorry guys, doing a lot of renovating. As you can see, I got a lot of stuff moving in and out. Had a wild party last night. There's cars everywhere. Incredible Hawk came to my party, it was crazy. Stopped throwing shit. Cars just flying, you see, you see what he did? Party, look, now we gotta clean up.
look at me on camera, huh? Like, it's not in your pocket. <laughs> Caught you. Can't go nowhere. Can't go nowhere. The foot hanging on here. Girls be like, this is Chris Brown. That's cute and all, but. What's up? The bus. <laughs> Tired, bro. I ain't been doing shit all day. Went to the movies. After Earth is an incredible movie. Incredible movie. We over here. Okay, this is what we do. Six in the morning. Switch the camera on. Look at X. Passed out. X. Hey. Yeah, like, don't fuck with me right now. Don't you see me getting some shut eye? <laughs> <laughs> Who's winning? Let's look at this shit. I'm losing about two right now. Don't put it on there right now until I come back. It's fucking. What's the movie still? The back. The dude, dude. We're in the back room, everybody. We're like sleeping at night, you know. So I'm just bored, man. So just letting everybody say what I ain't doing shit. I got ass in my book, nigga. Look. Hold up. Who got our pants in their bunk? I got our bunk niggas six in the morning, you know we tired. Look, look what that say. Them niggas ain't boo. You see it? We in here, I'm tired, so I'm, I'm gonna stop acting a fool. I'll see you guys in the morning. Bye. I just took a flight to Geneva. Just wanted to come clip my head, get everything right, think about some other concepts for me to write for music. You know, just something different. 
sometimes you just need that time to get away and just think about life. So, you know, bring y'all with me, I guess. I guess y'all see me. So, love y'all. My girl's titties. With my hand, I'm gonna slap the shit out of Chris Brown. Hey! What's up? Motherfucker! Jay! Oh, you didn't give me my Black Pyramid jersey, motherfucker! So the first one is here. The first one is here. Look, first, here. Second one, here. Third one, boom, boom. Alright? Yeah, this is that one. Seven, eight. Maybe that. That's good, huh? Yeah. Feel good? Yeah. 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 One, waist. One, clap. One, two, three, four. Oh, my dude. <laughs> That's that right there. Matter of fact, y'all should walk down and run back this way. Okay, who picking I'm them a, up? I'm gonna run beside him with the camera. It's crazy right now. We about to get Pat to race Big D.
Let's go, Pat. What do you think? Big D went down. He went down 15 seconds into the race, baby. He got extra springs on the sneakers. He was never running down here, dude. CB. Oh, my God. I know. Over here recording this shit. Oh, we ain't gonna put the close up on you. They gonna never see you. They got me. Y'all got me. Y'all got me. Go. Go. This is how. I got chucks on, feel like I'm in the 70s. This is how they used to run and play. Yeah. <laughs> Just go and tell him that I put it down. How are you? How are you, man? Hey, the story you wrote was amazing. Yeah. It was amazing, it inspired me. He did this for you. Oh, what Rod King. Thank right? you. And, and he did one for him. Thank so, you. So this you. <laughs> yes, this gift for Muhammad. It's your pictures. I was living in the dark, but I found the light. When I found you, now I can start focusing on my dreams all because of you. Because I'm always alone, I knew that the day I got to meet you, I would meet a real friend. That to me is an offense more priceless than anything in the world. I'm so I'm so touched. I'm like, oh, thank you so much, Mo. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> I'm fly in the sky, out of space, by satellites. Wanna take a, a little ride on your rocket, yeah, yeah, your rocket. Hit it for the Milky Way, your big surprise. Looking for the sugar rush, I, are you the guy? You delighted if I was invited, so tell me how about it, yeah. Definition of a freak, yeah. Let's do something crazy, yeah I want you, and you want me And I don't need you Your dream, your ring, it don't mean shit to me Just keep your money in your pocket Everything up in here, I don't know No fake ID, just keep it real with me You know you want me, boy, just stop it Let me hop on your love pocket Drink on it, she cold. 
my zipper down, but my money up. Better get your ass up on that pole. Two more shots and I'm out. Block, block, then I reload. Got it, might earn 20 more. Get your ass up on that pole. Damn, look at Lakeisha getting that money. Just like it's Easter. All of these bunnies, bunnies, hopping and popping. Fighting to get up in my two seater. My chain, six rings. Bitch, I'm in the motherfucking game. Taking 23 shots, that's a MJ. I mean, a fade away. We about to fade away. She said she like my pants. I think she like my pockets. Bitch, I'm in the building counting millions. Oh! What's up guys? My name is Ugo Mosier and I'm a fashion and celebrity stylist. Today we're on set of Nylon Mexico shooting their September cover with Chris Brown. Nylon Magazine is a very lifestyle driven magazine. It represents an artistic person and Chris Brown being not only a recording artist, he's also a painter. So in this magazine shoot, we're going to basically show both sides. Capture him actually painting real pieces on set while looking amazing shooting the cover of Nylon Magazine. It's just different. We can take it slow. My name is Quelly Calderon and I am a makeup artist and male groomer and I've been with Chris, I think it's about seven years now. He's so handsome and he has great skin. I groom the eyebrows, make sure that everything is in order. It's very minimal. I always tell him, you're nice looking, work the nice looking. The concept behind this shoot is pretty much to capture art and music together. I feel like we have a very good understanding of clothes. It's very effortless, it's very simple. I know what he likes. I'm loving like three pieces the most. There's this orange suit that I like a lot. And there's these khaki pants, the yellow stripe down the side. I love that so much. And the all white classic look, these acne denim jeans and LJM label shirt with painting his hands. We're gonna incorporate some paints into the actual outfit. So that should be one of the funnest looks. He does all kinds of art, but his graffiti work stands out the most to me. He's painted with the best all over the world, and now he's going to be painting with us today. I never really knew that he was an artist in that sense. So to see that he can translate what he's feeling in his mind and his heart into his artwork, I think it's a great outlet. You already know, top nine crew. It's six o'clock in the morning right now in the airport, and we're dancing. So, just having fun. Yeah. They haven't stopped us. This is top nine crew top in the house, yo. In the house, straight from Russia. Russia. Fade away. She said she like my pants. I think she like my pockets. Bitch, I'm in the building counting millions. You should try. Yeah, what you mean? She tried to kiss me. I said stop. Put that money in her face. Then she get that pussy popping, 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 popping. What does Team Breezy and what does Team Breezy mean? How, how do you get in Team Breezy? You know, I think Team Breezy started out as like a little small fan club and real, real big supporters. And from there, the internet, you know, Twitter, and it kind of grew and escalated. Team Breezy all day, every day. 
Yay! I'm so proud of you, even though I don't know you. No matter what, I got to support yeah. you all day. Steve all Breezy day. got your back. Oh, I love you so much. Let me pick this bitch. <laughs> oh my God, you are Chris Brown, all day. You, all day. Steve Breezy, all day. Number love for you. Love you, Breezy. They have the whole worldwide way of knowing you know, what my mixtape's doing, how my songs are being played. You know, Team Breezy is expanding now. So we got Team Breezy, France, Australia, you know, Japan, you know, everywhere. So many people and so many fans who are dedicated in supporting the art and my talent, you know, and, and what I what I can bring to the game. So, you know, Team Breezy is the end all be up. Without y'all, I wouldn't be right here. What's up, y'all? It's Chris Brown. Just wanted to welcome you out to my channel again. All the fans, man, I appreciate you guys so much. You mean a lot to me. You mean the world to me. Everything I do, my music, I know you're hearing a lot of new stuff. The new song with me and Nikki is about to come out real soon. So I'm hoping you guys are excited. I've uh, been working real hard on this X album. Uh, you know, just been focusing on my music and, you know, trying to stay out of trouble. <laughs> I know you see a headline every other day, but what's news? Um, but, you know, I just want to thank all my fans, man. I appreciate everybody. Appreciate all the love, appreciate all the support. And, you know, just been working hard. I'm trying to stay my black ass in the house. All right. I'm so sorry, y'all. Uh, but I gotta do this. And now my ladies Paddle, open my clothes. Paddle, 